Hey guys, Travis here, and uh, it was just announced earlier tonight that Paul Bearer is going to be inducted into the WWE Hall of Fame along with Lita, the Ultimate Warrior, and Jake the Snake Roberts. Here's my personal recollections of Paul Bearer. I remember when I was a small boy um, seeing Paul Bearer on the TV. My father used to watch a lot of wrestling when I was growing up. I remember, um, God, I had to be at least three, two, three, year, four years old. And uh, I remember I was uh, playing with my toys, and every single time my uh, father used to flick on uh, the, um, the wrestling, Paul Bearer would be doing these promos with The Undertaker. And I was a little bit scared of The Undertaker, but I was terrified of Paul Bearer because he had such a high shrieking voice, and he was just so scary, and he really made The Undertaker uh, a, a full um, character. And uh, I really loved Paul Bearer later on during the Attitude Era. And when he came back at WrestleMania 20, I totally marked out because I thought that that was just absolutely wonderful. You could, I don't, in my mind, I don't think you could have brought back the Dead Man Undertaker unless you had Paul Bearer uh, with them, with him. So um, uh, it's totally deserved. As for everybody who knows, Paul Bearer passed away tragically. I think it was last year or the year before, but I think it was last. I think it was last year. Paul Bear tragically passed away after uh, a problem with his, uh, I think it was his heart. Uh, Paul Bear, uh, William Moody, Percy Pringle, uh, he started his career um, down in uh, Fritz von Erich's territory uh, in the WCCW, and then he came up to the WWE um, as Paul Bear, and uh, throughout the 90s he was just tremendous. Uh, when he was working with Mankind, when he was working with Kane, when he was working with Vader, um, obviously The Undertaker, uh, during that 1990, 1990, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six era, and, uh, obviously Paul Bearer had a lot of, uh, personal demons when it came to his, his weight, he was a very, he was a very, uh, he was a very big man, and, um, he, uh, you know, he, he, he had a lot of, tragedies in his life when he lost his wife he uh, his son and his daughter lost his son and his daughter-in-law uh lost their baby girl he lost his grandchild and um you know uh, and he came back through all that and it truly is a, a tragic thing to lose such a great man and uh, you know I, I wish i could have met him before he passed away but um uh, uh, totally deservingly paul bear deserves to be in the wwe hall of fame so paul bear as The Undertaker would say, rest in peace. I'm Travis Walsh. That's my opinion.